know what's going on. <clears throat> I don't. But I said, Jesus, let's give the Aries a message before I go on and turn it in. And my pen just got the right. My pen just got the right. You see that? Somebody is in a trollop slut hole energy. They fake. They ain't using their wisdom. And they lying like a motherfucker. They lying to they self and they lying to everybody they deal with. They embellish so motherfucking much. They always switch the truth. They said they are lying. The truth ain't in them. Aries, it may be you or you may be dealing with a trollop, a slut, a hussy, a thotamus prime. It could be male or female. But they sh- a straight liar. They fake as fuck. And, and they don't understand that uh, you done peered through it. You done peered through it, Aries. Mm-hmm, motherfucker is a liar, they a hoe, they a slut, they ain't got no wisdom, they ain't got the good sense that God gave them, that's what the G's said, they on the shit brick road, they don't mind the shit brick road, they don't, they don't mind the shit brick road, they always on the shit brick road, they always got something going on, the G's said, that's what fuel they fired on. They be stuck on stupid and locked down on done and always stuck in this petty energy. They're fraud. Aries, whoever it is, they're fraud. I hope it's not you. We're going to see. We're going to see what's going on. Thank you, Most High. Thank you, Spirit Guides. Thank you, Ancestors. Keep us strong. Kick up us. Kick us. Kick us up off this shit brick road if we own it. Yeah, that's what I heard. Let's see what's going on. Aries, like, share, and subscribe. I thank you for listening, for listening, and coming to chill with me and my G's because they've been hollering at yours. You feel me? Yeah, they've been hollering at yours. It's time for me to go to sleep. It is. But they want you to know. Some shit. You may be seeing repeated numbers. Recognize, analyze, and realize synchronicity when it fall in your lap. The G said. Feel like I'm talking to somebody who up in age. Yeah. Somebody who up in age. The G's want you to know everything happened for a reason too. Everything happens for a reason. It wasn't written in stone. But, you know, the shit happened. It's level to this shit. Plateaus. It's been some shit already written for your growth, is what the G said. Don't trip. Everything happened for a goddamn reason. It ain't no race, but you didn't hit the ground running full speed ahead, my G said. Some shit all right in your world. But they want you to pay attention to your lifestyle. How old are you? Yeah, recognize, analyze, and realize you ain't no spring chicken no more. They want you to take care of you. Use you with care is what they said. Use yourself with care. You changing physically, they said. That's just because you up in age. Yeah, you that's just because you up in age. And you secretly gay. They said lesbian behavior. That's what they said. You see them repeating numbers. And you are secretly gay. You like women. Um. Yeah. From talking to a woman. They said you ain't using your wisdom. And you a liar. They said you a liar. And you fake. And you a slut. That's what the G said. Hey don't shoot the messenger. They said you a trollop. A hussy. A slut. (laughs) That is what they said. And you secretly gay. 
that's what they said. They said you, you secretly gay. But everything happens for a reason. You ain't no motherfucking spring chicken. What about them numbers you seeing though? You been paying attention to those numbers? You been seeing repeating numbers? Yeah. Get about this lying ass energy they said. They said you always lying. You always leaving out the truth too. They said you leave out the truth and you tailor any story to your advantage. That's what the G said. You tailor it all to your advantage to make you seem like you are the wise one when you are not. They said you still got a lot to learn. Yeah, they said you ego-driven too. You ego-driven and you put all your energy into finding somebody to lay up with. They said you ain't even paying attention to you or your household. Your kids, they they said you ain't even paying attention to this, sex, this sexual behavior that you have. But you are because you got somebody in your eyesight that you want of the same sex that Jesus said. That's what they said. You got somebody in your sight that you want that is of your gender. Everything happens for a reason, though, they said. Everything happens for a goddamn reason. Oh my goodness. Let's see what's going on, Aries. Let's stay encouraged. Let's try to get up off this shit brick road. They say you lie on the regular. You lie on the regular. And you fucking up out of both draw legs. You jump out of the fire, the, the pan into the fire. You don't want to be by yourself. You feel as though you got to be connected with somebody sexually and you equate sex with love. They said, stop that, stop that, stop that. And what about this being secretly gay? Look at the world. Look at the world. You ain't got to keep that a secret. You ain't got to keep that a secret. I feel like somebody in your family know it, though. Somebody in your family know you like girls. They do. Yep, somebody in your family know you like girls. You may be having some car issues right now. Got somebody in your energy that's petty and weak as fuck, and they jealous of you, too. They jealous of you. What about this secretly gay? You looking for a new spot. You just fell into... A new business, a new job, a new position. You have been restless with your coins, the G said. The G said you want some perfect contentment with the earth sign. You've been quick on your feet about some shit, too, about hiding, about hiding how you feel about this earth sign. Yeah. You try to, the G said. You do, you try to. What else? You look at this earth sound like they a boss. Yeah. But they know that you weak and have a, a, a some ugliness about you. They see this perverse ass spirit too. They've been paying attention. They have. They've been paying attention. Paying attention to this unreliable negative energy that you embody. You always come in with some bad news, they said. Always come. That's what the G said. You always come in with some bad news and you jealous and envious of this earth sign. They sympathetic towards you. They got a lot of compassion and love for you. The G said they have been your crutch. And they have supported you through some shit. That's the type of energy that they embody. They were something like a fairy. But you desire this person. You love sick. You love sick when it comes to this earth sign. 
Everything happens for a reason, though. It was already written. There's levels to this shit. What plateau you want to be on, G said. Because you vibing low. And you, you, you play victim a lot, is what the G said. You're not the victim, tink, tink. What else? You got sexual demons. They want you to know that. But you know it because you 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 scuba diving in, in Lake Minnetonka. But she said your family. You need to start entertaining your family and saving some money. Yeah. That's your creation right there. You looking you you kind of in and out about this earth sign though, G said. You looking at them like they toxic, but then you 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 looking at them like you could be a power couple, but you ain't even stepped up to the plate for yourself. I don't feel as though because you 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 fucking men and women, and you you got some money issues right now. You've been counting and saving with a little small worries and shit. The G said, this storm gonna pass. You need to be in hermit mode, though. They said, you need to be in hermit mode so you can shed some of these sexual demons. But you, it's like you scared to be by yourself, is what the G said. Once you get through with one, then you on to the next. You don't have time to be by yourself. You done lost your identity. Your energy so scattered that you, you think that you right. The G says, psych, psych, your, mo- your motorbike. Psych, psych, your motorbike. Well, as though you may wear a uniform. May have a job that requires you to wear one. You got some fickle ass energy. Petty. Petty energy. You think folk jealous of you. Ain't nobody jealous of you. You want some forgiveness too from somebody. You want some forgiveness from somebody. Somebody who want to see you. My G says somebody gonna be coming towards you like a mother figure or something with some good advice. He says sidestep that shit. They can't be trusted. Sidestep it. They can't be trusted. Beware the deceit and avoid the bullshit. They want you to sidestep blind acceptance of others. You're in contemplation right now about your desires. You feel as though it's going to be some attainment there. That's just in your imagination is what the G said. It's just in your imagination. But you need to be true to you so you can be true with everybody around you. That is what the G said. It said you gossip too much. You just you gossip too much. You always in some type of dispute because you you jealous hearted. You cause a lot of quarrels. Yeah, it's confirmed. You are you are bisexual. It's confirmed. You are bisexual. Um, you had battle with yourself. They don't want you to take no advice from this water sign coming. You made some new friends, though. They was real friends. Something like your soul family. Alliances have been made. But they are a memory of the past now. Or they will be. They not going to be there. There will be no renewals either. Folk looking at you like you bad luck. Vibe low. He says you need to go to the doctor too. You want you to know that it's some messy folk at your at your work. You may have some job issues coming up, and I think this was just something that fell in your lap, an achievement of some sort. Um, this job, but they say it's messy folk there. 
They want you to pay attention. They want you to pay attention. Somebody you're talking to, they want you to have some caution. They want you to stay safe, be careful, and think first because this person is trying to create some obstacles. They don't want you to take no advice for them. All they want to do is set up roadblocks. That's all they want to do is set up roadblocks. They don't want you to be happy in love. They don't want any love and happiness to even be in your realm of being. But that those problems are lifting. You won't have no more drama. You're sad about somebody dishonoring you. You're a little disturbed by how they play their hand. But you said this is a blessing in disguise. It was a blessing in disguise. Got a new job coming. Some disloyalty at this present job, though. You're going to have a change in your business. You're going to be promoted, my fire sign. Everything happens for a reason. They want you to pay attention to these repeating numbers. They want you to research them. They're going to coincide with how you feel. Yeah. I see triple zeros. One, one, one. Mm -hmm. So, secretly gay. Why is it a secret? Clarify the secretly gay. You've had some quarrels with somebody that you want. Of the same sex. You want to be their lover. You admire them. You look them. You look at them as faithful. You look at them as faithful, and you feel as though that's where your love and happiness will really be abundant because this person is truthful. They loyal. Dealing with somebody of the opposite sex, my G said, who was in this Chris Bender energy. This person is not to be trusted. This person is not to be trusted. You yourself are not faithful. You play with folks' feelings. It says you need to be in hermit mode. You need to keep your legs closed. That's what the G said. You need to keep your damn legs closed. Because that's what causes all your obstacles. Because you play, you playing games with yourself. You're taking a chance on your happiness. These interactions you be having, be having you fucked off in your goddamn spirit and shit. Because you equating dick and pussy with love. They want you to count your blessings. It's a lot of changes that has come about on this journey of yours, but it's a lot of hidden motives too. It is a lot of hidden motives and you have the hidden motives. The G says you done withheld valuable information to help folk move forward. You you feel like you the only one who needs to be on top. And you wonder why the G said why shit really Ain't going in your favor. You have some attainment for a while, but then it's back to the shit brick road. And you you, you, you walk back off on that shit brick road because you be lonely. The G said, learn to love your own energy. Love your own company. Mm -hmm. That's what they said. Learn to love your own company. You need to retreat. You, they, 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 they want you to pull yourself back um, and quit this emotional manipulation in this lust because it's just sex and a lot of it is what they're saying. That's where you feel as though you achieve your peace and your victory. But you know what the G said? That's false advertisement. There ain't no achievements there. All you're doing is getting a wet ass. Ain't nobody helping you for real. That's what the G said. But you feel like that's where your victory and your perfection is. That's where your peace is. 
You manipulating your own goddamn self. You keep bumping your head against shit brick rugs. But you feel as though you know what's best for you. But you, you, you. And you find a profit in other folks' sadness and they tears. You do. Don't shoot the messenger. That's what the G's said. You worried about something right now, too. The G says you're a little weary. You're not trustworthy. You're not honoring nobody but yourself. You're not loyal. Ain't no love there. That's what the G said. Ain't no love there, but you desire love, but ain't no love in your temple. Ain't no love in your heart. That's what the G said. They want you to switch up this energy. Just as soon as you can can make you can align yourself properly. Um, align yourself properly and level up. It says you ain't no goddamn spring chicken no more. If you like girls, if you like boys, however it resonates, keep that shit real with yourself so you can be real with everybody else around you. Because by you keeping this secret, they said, you, it, it's kind of recognizable. Motherfuckers catch the way you look at the same sex. Yeah, you are at a new job. And you want to find love. You need to find love with, within yourself is what the G said. You got to love on you first. You got to practice self-care, self-love. When you got time, they want you to they want you to create some changes within your spirit, man. Your higher self is wanting you to switch the game up. You picking up pennies. And won't to act like you were dying. But they said, shit, you caused your own misfortune. You put death and endings to anything that's good in your life because you got sexual demons. You gonna dip yourself in a Lake Minnetonka mistakenly without no scuba deer is what the G said. You won't be getting no coochie or no dick after that. That's what the G said. That's what they said. They want you to be cautious. You know that this path, yeah, they want you to be cautious and stay safe. Be careful and think first. You, 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 and this, you, you, you angry. You got a lot of anger in you. You angry at this earth sign. For them not, for them not seeing that you want them like that. You've been doing black magic. You've been doing black magic, some candle magic. Yeah, you you've been doing black magic and some candle magic. The G said. Mmm, you done did it multiple times too. Uh, motherfuckers got free real, free. Will they said black magic, you dirty bitch? Stop that. That's what my G said. Oh, they talk crazy. You dirty bitch. They said stop that. They about to put an end to that. Oh yeah, they about to put an end to that. It's gonna be some blessings raining down because angels answer. Yeah, they do all this fucking that is bringing you great joy and you you you, you know. And when you can't have nothing that you don't, that you feel as though you're restricted in some areas. You're restricted from this same sex, right? So, you been doing some black magic and you're not even good at it. That's what they said. You're not good at it. You want success and love, marriage. You want some second chances out here. You want a long-term proposition to come from somewhere. You know what I'm saying? You want your money to look up because you you having a little bit of money issues and somebody got something to say to you. Somebody, somebody got something to say to you. What else? 
What happened, though? They said everything happens for a reason. You had too much evil intent. They said you were an imposter. You fake as fuck. You got to get up out that energy. How you expect for something good to fall in your lap or pop up at your doorstep and you can't keep it real? You can't keep it real? Oh, goodness. They said you fake them a motherfucker. Your family know it, too. You done broken a bunch of promises to your family. Yeah, sometimes they a little bit shameful. You feel me? They disappointed in you. They got a lot of doubt about this shit brick road you on, and they fearful in some cases. But you, you, you be experiencing some joyous occasions leaving your family on the back burning. The G says you need to pay attention to your family. ASAP. That's where your prosperity lies. That's where your happiness is, is with your family. They say pay attention to your family. You have not done so because you out here being a trawler for hussy and a slut. And they said you a liar. Quit lying so damn much. What's wrong with you that you can't tell the truth is what the G said. What else? Wait, they said grab these other ones. I surely will. They said what is wrong with you that you can't tell the truth. You arrogant. You in some despair right now because you are disconnected. Don't nobody really trust you. They don't. You got a lack of faith. You do. You in a leadership position. But since you've experienced so much betrayal, that's what you expect. You feel as though you the shit, is what my G said. News break, you ain't. They said you not. You got a crown of hope, but you not using it to your advantage. You you scheming and dealing and 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 lying on a regular basis, they said. Yeah, you lying on a regular basis and you you're highly intuitive. Highly intuitive. But right now you feeding your dreams. You in the flow of feeding your dreams. You trying to stay honest and devoted and caring and have some compassion for those around you. They said you haven't been a good mom. While feeding your dreams. You've been codependent on, on, on these people who making you bust one. It's about to be some dismantling of some shit. Perhaps all. Job loss, relationship crum crumbles, no money. You said you got a wrong choice at work right now. This is some lies that's about to come to the surface. It's going to be a storm, some straight bullshit, the G said. But they want you to not to panic and to confront it all calmly. You got some fear and some doubt about your next steps. Got some blessings coming. Blessings is going to be this clarity. It's going to be blessings that come up out of this storm. Yeah, they want you to do some shadow boxing because you half and half. And you savage with this dark side, the G said. You tenacious as hell. But you dealing with your sexuality. You are. They want you to deal with yourself. They do. They want you to deal with yourself. And pay attention. To your family details. You got some family matters that you're not paying attention to. The G said. Yeah. And they said you already know how that feel. Not to be paid attention to. You've been through that already. You looking at this earth sign. Like they. Like they a queen. Like they a goddess. They a beautiful soul. The G said. This earth sign can see both worlds. They smart as fuck. And they very. Very gifted. Very gifted. You you want the power to build with this person. Yeah. You want to birth something with this person. You've been brainstorming and trying to think of how you're going to holler at them and create a love affair. Be cautious, the G said. You better be cautious. Because this earth sign. Mmm.
this earth sign coming in as the head bitch in charge. Very nurturing. They got some doubt about you. They didn't put you to rest, the genie said, because it's a lot unknown because you lie too much. This earth sign's crown is on. Yeah, they, 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 they crown is on. And um, they're good natured and they're a homebody. And so are you. You love money. You interested in the opposite sex and the same sex. You digging everybody. You digging everybody. You coming in as a loving, honorable woman, but you got that other side to you where you motherfuckers opponent, but you you're charming while doing so. You bring a lot of wrath and destruction, but then you be defensive about when a motherfucker check you about it. Jesus have mercy on the Savior. It's going to be some shit made known. It's going to be illuminated, the Jesus said. It's going to make you no longer self-conscious. It's going to liberate your soul. You're going to accomplish what you want. Material success. You got love around you. You hear me? You got love around you. You're you, 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 you really trying to get to know yourself. You're an extrovert. You're very outgoing. You're always looking for some type of adventure, the G said. And these adventures be these options in your back pocket that cause a bunch of disappointment. They said, ain't you tired of this shit, Brick Road, Jay? You can have some physical suffering going on right now. You are experiencing some sadness, too. Dis-ease is in your body. Dis-ease is in your body, and that's because you've been dual in nature and very two-faced it. Yeah, very two-faced. It. You look at folks' body and not their soul. That's wrong right there. Check a, check a person's energy and their soul and their heart. It ain't nothing physical. This is all spiritual out here. Recognize, analyze, and realize. Yeah, you don't, you, you, you don't look. You don't look deep. Whatever's about to happen, the G said it was bound to happen. And it's going to be made for you to release some baggage because they need you to get up out of this energy. Make a transition to a different level because there's levels to this shit. There's levels to this shit. Be who you are and, and stick the chest out and have your head up held high. That's what the G said. You're making allies right now. You really don't have any focus on the relationship. You just want to fuck. Yeah, you just really, you just want to fuck. They want you to release that way of doing shit and balance your emotions. Cause right now you a little moody. You a little moody, and you always got some ill will towards the men. 